It's high noon. We're playing the San Diego Chargers. Let's take a look at the San Diego Chargers. Actually, hold on. Let's let's go ahead and change some players around. Mike Pagel, you're getting the call. You and your 25 pass speed and 31 passing control is getting the call today. Arizona State product. Curtis Dickey, you're getting the call. Herman Fontenot, you too. You're in bad condition. Strap it up. Webster, you're playing today. Gerald, you're hurt, so one of my other receivers has got to play. Ozzy, you're getting a break today too. We're, we're sitting them all. This is going to be a shit show. Webster Slaughter will be in for Brian Brennan. Holtz in there. There we go. This is. I, I apologize to the fans in advance who paid for this game. You're going to get the B team because I don't need my best guys getting all busted up. I cannot swap out anybody on defense. Let's take a look at the San Diego, San Diego Superchargers and Dan freaking Fouts in excellent condition. Boy, they're underplaying him. He was still really good at the end of his career. For him to be downplayed so much that an excellent, he's average, is really disappointing. He was still pretty damn good in 87, 86. Gary Anderson, he's pretty good. Tim Spencer. Wes Chandler, he's better than that. Charlie Joyner was also Way better than that. I mean, these guys were kind of on the tail end, but they are still way better than that. Lionel James, he was way better than that. It's like the microwave, something like that is what they called that guy, Kellen Winslow. All right, so at least they, they give Kellen Win Winslow a nod. Come on now. Pete Holohan, he was pretty good too. Leslie O'Neill, absolute monstrosity. He's probably going to give me a hard time. Chuck Ein. Williams, he's a shit. Their defensive freaking two defensive ends are good. Gary Plummer, he was good too. Billy Rez Smith. He's in bad, but he was a decent player too, man. Donald Brown, he's all right. Gil Bird, absolute freaking nightmare. He's really good in the, uh, they put him on corner in the 91 Tecmo Super Bowl. All right. What kind of offense do they run? Pitch, pitch to Anderson, off tackle, off tackle, direct snap, play action, off of pass one, bunch of uh, run and gun stuff, and they run our pass four. Okay. Okay. We can get this done with our, uh, our B team. Let's see how the B team does. Let's auto skip through week 16. And this will get us to the playoffs, guys. Washington. St. Louis. Houston. Raiders. Sea Chickens. 49ers. Detroit. Dallas. Kansas City. Jets. Vikes. Giants. Here we go, boys. Let's get it. All right, here we go, guys. Week 16 of our Quantum Leap. Trying to write what once went wrong for the Cleveland Browns. We'll see. Play fake. Yes! Stan Fouts throwing a pick on the first play of the game. And with that, we're going up top, Mike Pagel. Freaking 
took Ein. Those guys are all over me. We were trying to go up top on the first play. Didn't matter. God bless. That's two sacks in a row. I think Leslie O'Neill's just blowing through our tackle on the on the play side. He's just popcorning him. Get, Bagel gets the pass off. Oh, he throws a pick on his first pass. That's not good. <laughs> The hell was that? Maybe I was over giving Dan Fouts too much credit, man. Bob Golick with a huge sack party. There you go D. That's how you stop him. Please kick this in the end zone. Thank you. I do not want to try to have Mike Pagel and company try to get that thing out of my own freaking cop. Freaking Leslie O'Neill is just gonna. He is dominant. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Watch, watch number, watch number two. Boom! Popcorn. Uh, another pick by Mike Pagel. <laughs> oh my god. We're so screwed. Leslie O'Neill is going to have the best day in the history of football. And then he cranks with another big sack. Quarterback play is poor in this game so far. Trying to hold him to a field goal attempt on that. Yes! And a blocked field goal! Pick it up! Let's go! <laughs> this first quarter's been absolutely bonkers. <laughs> Guys, can anybody block Leslie O'Neill? Okay, we did! Get it up, Mike Pagel! Look at the rainbow nuke! Get up there, Langhorn! <laughs> we can't do anything. Leslie O'Neill's gonna destroy us. There! Oh, we popcorned him. Yeah, try to run the ball. What were we thinking? Nope. I, I couldn't get the. I couldn't get it out. Oh my god. We've been sacked like five times. We'll kick the field goal. Get that. All right. We're up three nothing. I don't know how. Come on, D. West Chandler. Big play. Chip Banks is a huge play. Showing him the sack. Defenses are just un. Believable today. I mean, it's just bonkers. I think it's gonna be a sack here too. Nope, they did the pitch. Oh, I had him. He just outran me. Freaking! We're gonna set the league. The <laughs> We're going to set the league record for sacks, total sacks in a game. So that's another one, Eddie Johnson's sack show. It's just ridiculous. <laughs> Get him! 
Oh, he got it off! <laughs> what is happening in this game? <laughs> Our defense is like, oh, you're going to sit all the starters on offense? That's fine. We'll just dominate. Meanwhile, we have no answer for Leslie O'Neill. None. <laughs> If he doesn't get, if we don't flatten him, he just destroys us. <laughs> All right, we held him. Oh, we got a yard. Boom, pop. Oh, we got him. There's nobody open, but he did stop him. Go, Pagel. Get it, Mike Pagel. Get it up, Mike Pagel with the nuke! You can't even see the ball, it's so overthrown! <laughs> I got a punt. It's fourth and four, and I got a punt. That makes me so sad because I don't think my I don't think I can block Leslie O'Neill. And because I don't think I can block him, I gotta punt it. Oh, he almost got the punter on that. That's some freaking roughing the kicker. I mean, right now, my defense is doing pretty good, so. Play fake. Everybody's open. Oh, shit. I mean, freaking three nothing at the half. It's just a clown show. Good Dicky, big return, huge play. Now Pagel, let's get it done. Actually, play side tackle. Get the oh, get off me. Nobody open, so Pagel's gonna run. Okay. Nobody's open. Pig will run it. Come up a yard. He's short. He's short. Come on, Fontenot. Let's get the first down. Just need one. We got five. We'll take it. Fontenot, another couple. Trying to keep the defense honest. Pagel gets it off! Huge catch by Holt! Thought no! Yes! Yeah! <laughs> Herman Thought no for Mike Pagel! Let's go! Oh, it got that right over the top of me. I had that. We're on that. Oh, what the shit? Come on. I mean, I get that as Charlie Joyner, but I had two dudes down there. And we had it read the whole way. Yes! Get out of here with that. Clay Matthews making the difference right there. Block A pair of block kicks in this game? Hell yeah, that's making the difference. Woo! Oh, oh no! Dickie's out! I'm gonna put Biner back in! 
Damn. All right, Biner, get back in there. I guess we'll, uh, I guess, uh, no. Shit. I guess Mac will return kicks. Shit. Probably put Herman Fano back there, actually. Let's do that. Let's put Herman Fano in there. There you go. Oh, oh my god. Holy crap. Oh, it was just everything I could do to just get the ball out of his hands. Third and eight. All right. Come on, boys. Everybody's covered. Go, Piggle. Oh, that's a huge run. Oh, they didn't give it to us. Fuck it. We're going for it. Get me one. That's what we needed. Scrambled by Mike Pagel. Defense is juicing up. I missed the freaking tight end wide open over the middle on that. Boom. Webster Slaughter. A terrible throw by Pagel. Oh, man. I don't want to punt it, but I have to. It's fourth and three, man. You just you make a play. Let's go. Bam. Oh no! Damn it. Okay. So you got to get your backups a shot, a, a chance to shine here. So. Don't nobody ever say that Dan Fouts didn't just freaking air it out because he has aired it out in this game. I mean, he's just been just winging it. Nice job, D. Defense looking good today. Draw play. Stuff that thing on fourth down. Let's see what Herman Fontenot can do. Herman Fontenot can get stuffed for no gain or for a two-yard loss. No! Shit! Damn it! Now, defense, I need you guys to step up and just finish it off. Nothing crazy. There it is, boys. Eddie Johnson with the sack show. Oh, no, I got freaking popcorn. Oh, he got away with that shit. Oh, what a bunch of shit on that play. We had that guy totally covered. Come on, D. Come on. No, get out of here. We got it. Overthrown. Woo. Third down. Come on, defense. Damn it. No! 
Oh shit! Uh, we had it. I think we, we're going to pick up an L on this one. Uh, just the uh, the sheer pressure from their defense. I don't know if we would have done a whole lot better with our starters in there. Our defense played out of their mind today. I'm going to need to pretty much return the kick for a touchdown, which is not going to happen. Especially when he kicked it as far as you damn near can kick it. Uh, uh. Damn it. That's all right. I really just wanted to, those guys to shine, and they really didn't. They showed me why they're backups. All right, we had 14 carries, 36 yards. That's awful. Mike Pagel had seven carries for 28. Gary Anderson ended up really goring us late in the second half. Six carries, 52 yards. Dan Fouts really didn't perform to his Hall of Fame caliber. We held him in check pretty well. 46% completions, buck 44 with a pick. Charlie Joyner showed, though, four catches for 97. Reggie Langhorn had one huge catch for 40 yards. That's probably like one of the five passes that I completed the whole game with Pagel. He had two picks, especially early. The first quarter of this game was absolutely asinine. There we go. Let's finish the rest of week 17 with a Monday night game. Yep. New England and Miami. New England with the win there. Lorenzo Hampton. Marino throws four picks. And he <laughs> four picks. Tony Eason with two. This is the turnover show on that game. All right. We're at the playoffs, guys. Jets get in. We, we kept Cincinnati out. That's what we like. Sea chickens in Kansas City. Look at Kansas City. Giants get in. St. Louis does not. Uh, choke job on their part. Detroit with the tie and a huge win over Chicago late gets in. And the ATL. Nobody else from the West. All right, so our first week playoff matchups. We're going to get... I'll go back and look at them again. Bears, Falcons, Vikings, Giants, and Lions, and the Giants get the bye. So, yeah, there you go. Patriots and the Sea Chickens in the first round. And the Chiefs and the Jets. The Cleveland Browns get the bye week. This is before they expanded the playoffs to six teams. They only had five back then. So, making the playoffs was a big deal. Bears, Falcons, huge season out of the Falcons, man. Lions, Vikings, and the Giants. There we go, boys. There we go. Boom goes the dynamite.